Never mind. Do you think that double-crossing dame could have given me a phony number? I thought you said you knew your types. Sure I did. You're the same class. It's one of the tinsel girls. What do you mean, tinsel? Looks swell on a Christmas tree, but you can't stand up in the rain. And when did you see me in the rain? Don't have to. After you've been around a while, you get the world pretty well classed. You're kidding yourself. You think you can guess them that easy? They print what I guess. Oh, yeah? And you never guess wrong. If you call them hard, they're hard. If you say they're tough, they're tough. Sweet, they're sweet. Beautiful, innocent. You never renege, never retract. Look at them once and you can't go wrong. Gee, it must be great to be the guy who knows all about women. Has its advantages. What's the matter? You'll have to get used to that. Eh? Yes, I'm on the job. Okay. Give me steak, 6030. Right. I'm expecting a call from a girl by the name of Jerry. One of the elevated girls? No, this is a different one. <laughs> yeah? Uh, emergency ward. Ambulance case. Hold up. Now, if this Jerry calls, will you tell... Yeah? This is the morning news. Have you got a police sergeant there named Antrim? Just brought him in? All right, now, don't give me that doing nicely stuff. Oh, uh, okay. Uh, if this Jerry calls, I want you to tell... What time? Hmm, notify the family? Okay, I'll catch him. Right. That's that. The copper kicked in. Oh, no. Sure, what about it? Seems terrible. Takes practice to live with a bullet in your heart. It's awful. What you need is a little nip. Come on. Uh, 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 uh. Our landlady's been cleaning up again. Watch out for her. I will. Say when. When? Oh, that's a girl. <laughs> Looks like you and I understand each other. Well, here's to Jerry. I hope she chokes. I hope she... I get it. <sighs> I know we understand each other. All we need now is a little music. Why not? Had another drink. Help yourself. Where have you been all my life? <laughs> hey, Steve. What is it? How about a good hot number? Oh, all right. Thanks. I got a swell friend here. Anytime she wants anything, give her the best in the house. I want you to meet her. She's bashful. Don't like to meet strangers. <laughs> Come on, baby, let's dance. What are you going to do about Anthony? Interview his family, stick pins in them, or make them cry. Are you glad Papa's dead? Sob. And when I sob, the farmers stop worrying about the rain. Come on, let's dance, baby. Wait a minute. Who shot him? Mm, I don't know. Some hoodlum by the name of Grant. Nick Grant. Big shot, huh? Who? One of the gang. Name some girl by the name of Madeline Levain. Police are looking for her now. Come on, baby. Who is she? Oh, I don't know. Some uh, police say she's the brains of the mob. Do you know her? No, I don't know her. Before I get through, I will. I'll have her on every front page in America. She'll be a national figurehead. Madeline Levain, Tiger Woman of the Underworld. Read this heartbreaking story in Saturday's feature section by Scott Cornell. I'm crying already. <laughs> you will. A picture like this. What? Uh, or like this. Oh, not like that. And I'll probably get a big bonus for it. Yeah? And we'll spend that bonus together. How about Jerry? If Jerry phones when I'm out, you tell her... Tell her I've got something better lined up. Here's the food. Oh, the groceries. And the prisoner ate a hearty breakfast. Nice kid. <laughs> <laughs>